Good morning, Centennial Couriers. I'm Dyson Campbell. And I'm Braden Greenwood. Thanks for joining us. This week, a big group of CHS students got an important lesson on civil rights. Originally, the Lorraine Motel was a very prominent African-American-owned motel here in Memphis, Tennessee. It was one of the few places that African-American artists um, and individuals could stay. The museum includes the Lorraine Motel, the place where civil rights leader Dr. Martin Luther King Jr. was assassinated. In addition to information about Dr. King, the museum also includes an exhibit dedicated to Rosa Parks, who refused to give up her seat on a bus. It was a different way to look at some of the stuff that we've been learning in history class. It kind of gave you an insight closer to yourself to understand some of the aspects that we couldn't really fully understand in class. It just told me the story of how people went through all these injustices and just how they went through all these trials and just to get freedom. It was very moving the first time I was here because we're literally standing in the presence, like around where um, Dr. King was assassinated. And that is very powerful. It's not very often that we get to be exactly where history happened. Yeah, it's, it was so cool because I wrote about um, Martin Luther King's assassination actually for our civil rights projects, uh, essays, assignments that we did. And it was so cool to see like all that research I did and like see the pictures but in real life. And, uh, it was so cool. Because I was actually stunned by all these pictures, by all these names that I had never heard before that really shaped my existence today and what my future will be tomorrow and like what my rights as an African American female are. A big thanks to Mr. Pate and all the people who helped chaperone on this important trip. Congratulations to the Symphonic Band. This week, the Symphonic Band earned superior ratings from all judges for their stage performance and sight reading performance at the Middle Tennessee Concert Performance Assessment. Also earning an invitation to the State Concert Festival. Our band boosters are once again offering senior yard signs as a service to our CHS families. Order forms are available online or in the Centennial front office. Orders are due no later than March 31st. Applications are now available in the Counseling Center for the PTSO Academic Scholarship. The scholarship is open to all CHS graduating seniors with a cumulative GPA of 3.75 weighted or higher. Four recipients, two female, two male, will be chosen in a random drawing during the Honors Program on April 24th. Anyone interested in joining the wrestling team for next season, please stop by room 239 and grab a form from Coach Pelkey with important summer information. Prom tickets are now on sale. You can buy tickets for $60 in room 227. Checks or cash are accepted. Prom is April 28th at the Cool Springs Embassy Suites. Hey Centennial, it's Christian Gillen. We're doing another game show this week and this week it's Riddles. Um, I start with M and end with the letter X. I have unlimited amount of letters inside of me. What am I? The Matrix. A mailbox. What, what, what can elephants make that no other animal can make? Baby elephants. He cheated. Okay, so like, don't film that, don't film that, just cut that off. Alright, I have a head and no body, but I have a tail. What am I? A coin. A, a coin. Oh, yeah, there you go. Good job. I can, oh, I can no. be made, but I can't be played. I can be cracked, but I can't be told. What am I? Yeah, I don't know. That's a tough one. I'm a joke. Oh, because you can be cracked. That's good. That's a really good one. What has a bed but doesn't sleep and a mouth that never eats? I don't know. A river. Uh, yeah. right, good job. How fast do librarians travel? Uh, uh. They book it. Nice. What time do ducks wake up in the morning? The quack of dawn. Oh, bet. I have a riddle for everybody. You have three switches on the outside and one light bulb on the inside. How do you know which switch turns on the light? Come to me in person and tell me if you know the answer. Today is the last day before spring break. We went out to see what you guys are planning to do with your week off. I'm with Ernie and I was wondering what you're doing for spring break. Nothing. Nothing? Me too, dude. Maybe we can hang out. Cool. I'm with Bradford and Joseph and I was wondering what y'all are doing for spring break. Uh, us and the boys are going down to the PCP. Gonna check out some waves. Uh, we're going, <coughs> we're going to Destin. I'm, I'm 
pretty sure I'm speaking for like all of us. We're going to Destin. Destin. I'm finna turn up. <laughs> turn up. <laughs> Florida with the boys. I'm with Aida Cruz, and I was wondering what you're doing for spring break. I'm celebrating my 17th birthday on Tuesday. Awesome. Happy birthday. Oh, uh, you know what they say? Out of school, time to fool and be cool. Have a, have a good trip. That's all our time for now. Thanks for joining us, and have a wonderful spring break.